Semantics is a branch of linguistics that is the study of human languages. There is logical semantics as well as lexical semantics. This is the question of the language we use and we are required to use that would make meaning within our respective professions. One Lord Denning, a most revered English judge, said, language is the tool of the lawyer. And he was right. I concur with him because in the area of legal practice, it is the language that one would deploy in order to be persuasive and convincing enough to the bench. This is the question of adversarial systems in which the manner in which the parties argue out their cases and convince the judge is what may determine the outcome of the court. But however still, we need to uphold the necessity and the role played by the language in our legal communication. Law has got its technical language, that is, certain technical terms that are used within the meanings of those terms. For instance, alimony, alibi, mens rea, as well as actus rea. There are so many other terminologies that are adopted and used from time to time during the court proceedings and litigations. That is not to bar non-lawyers from following the judicial process. It is to portray the meaning, to send the right message. It is the meaning of the word we use, the sentences, and also the meaning we make when we use certain expressions. This is what makes it more technical as well as unique when it comes to the ordinary applications of similar terms. This is to remind us about the communication skills that is now taught at the School of Law, University of Nairobi. It is taught in order to prepare the lawyers to be, to master language and the skills that are necessary for one as tools for the service in the legal sector. It is, again, true for so many professions, even in medicine, in engineering, and many other faculties and domains of professionalism. But law as a profession has got its distinct legal language known as legal parlance. In this manner, semantics becomes one of the key interests in teaching communications in, in law and mastery of such skills. There's so much that we learn from this, but for now this is sufficient to enable us to understand why the language is very important. Peter, University of Nairobi, School of Law, Kisum Campus. Thank you for watching. If you like it, share it. Bye for now and see you again in the next episodes.